Okay, we are playing uh, some Warsaw. Just came out early access. Oops. Uh, some settings. It's only an audio. Alright. Start a new one. Jump into it. So it's for a little like resistant group in uh, Poland. This tutorial, we we'll definitely should do it. Let's do it. The present begins before we get thrown in the deep end. We play short tutorial. All right, exploration. Right now, you're exploring a fragment of sea, and your party represented by a symbol. So this guy. You can see your current team moving toward the building. Actually, it's at the bottom. This is my team. 100 action points. This guy's got weapon skills, it seems like. Moving on the map to get your action points. Should you have action points, we plan to get the objection. Mission will result in a failure. For now, however, continue along the street to move your party toward the mouse cursor. Press more on the left, left, left mouse button. Street, the sewers of Warsaw, you run into enemies, loot, and multiple choice events. Certain enemies may force you into combat if they spot you, and you are in the danger zone represented by red circle. Set so, so the eye up and check if you can see you. This is the eye means they can see you. Assuming. Closed eye. If any of these encounters are nearby, an arrow will. Arrow displayed near party with an icon will direct to you. Initiate the encounter by pressing the party with clicking on a button on the event pop up. So I guess we're going up to this dude. We need ammo. Get some ammo. Before you set out for the rally point, first you just to arm yourself. Your team arrives, receive the Sign shared ammunition from a resistance arsenal. Not a moment too soon, that's patrol appears in the distance, like the alarm by the news right to the district. If you want to rendezvous, the uprising, you will have to fight your way through. So we get a bunch of ammo. Next event. Events usually offer multiple choices to pick from. Certain choices during the events may require spending resources or pass trait checks from one of your characters. Failing these checks will typically result in negative consequences or sometimes even death. All checks are clearly marked in the text. Now proceed with the party. Loading squad jobs, resource cash, discarded weaponry on the field will run. You will run into many opportunities to retrieve equipment for the uprising. When the loot window is open, you can click the items you wish to store in the inventory or the wall button. 
your inventory space is limited and you should go over capacity. I'm sure you go over capacity, you will need to leave some right now. Yeah. So got that. Fight. To the combat tutorial. <clears throat> activations in Warsaw, you begin each round with a number of activations equal the number of combatants on your side. Just so move three, then two. Activations required to perform skill besides alternate and using your activations in the current round ends with both sides. Use all of your allotted activations. I'll try activating the combat. So they want us to pick. This guy. Hide skill using the mouse button. Yeah. Like target bar. Take this dude out. Let's shoot him. I have successfully damaged an opponent with my skill, but it costs you some ammunition and a point of stamina. Stamina is displayed for the defense health level. Combat expected is rather than stamina level. Three no penalties, two accuracy, accuracy is reduced. Okay. One, all damage received with respect to one. You get a point to send each round. So there's some area effect skills. Let's move down. Trzeba to opatrzyć. Heal him up. Okay, so if you stand behind the obstacles, you get reduced damage. Or additional armor, which is reduced damage. With obstacles, will get damaged and reach the bridge. Let's see if there's skill options aside from using our offensive skills, just using your character or skipping the activation altogether. Or both use an activation, only movement affects stamina. So we're going to move him to a better position. Blinking combatants on both sides, like the towels with one of two horizontal lanes. All targets attacked from the other lane and considered flanks. And 50% bonus damage. This is both us and the enemies. It does not apply to enemy heavy weapons or armor. Chance of any chances though. 
Damy Fritzą popalić! Co jest bawcy ma... See the buffs right here. And hover those icons, yep. Happy. I can't do any skill. Super slow. Single shot. Damage. Hmm. Kill this guy. Kill the one though. This dude's burning. Talk about victorious. Okay. Remember, death is permanent. Sorry, I take this little quick. Whether in battle or events, it's vital to keep the characters alive and well, especially since their health is not automatically. Certain rewards may appear promising, sometimes it's better to limit your risk and look at that all together. from their first real engagement, your team ascends into the sewer network to reach the rally point. There's little time to celebrate, however, the hard part comes next. The uprising is now full swing, the long battle has been begun. Return to the hideout. Characters who suffer damage above a certain threshold of self and injury. Injuries will reduce characters' health and they return to have and want to be treated as impossible. Okay. What was the game? It's just like. I mean, it seems like it was made by them. Alright, it's got this like, this tile combat where certain characters can only fight or fight better in certain 